All right, so we're looking at the graphing points and coordinates module in Khan Academy. Here we get questions where they ask you to find points that are not usually included uh, on the graph. And they'll give you a list of points up here, and then you look at the graph below to see which one is not there. We're going to go over one question and, and remind you some basics in graphing here. So the first point is 1, negative 8. Now, Remember that with these graphs, you have two numbers because these numbers represent different variables, right? The 1 represents the x variable or direction, and the second number always represents, in this case, the negative 8, always represents the y variable or y direction. On the graph itself, right, your x-axis is the horizontal axis, and your y-axis is the vertical axis. They always meet at the origin, which is this point right here, 0, 0, right? There are also directions for positive and negative on the x-axis go to the right you're traveling in a positive direction flip that around you're going in a negative direction from the origin go up from the origin that's a positive y value and go down from the origin that's a negative y value so this point one negative eight start at the origin x is first go up one in the x direction and then down eight in the y direction to this point right here and that's one negative eight the next point is zero right two so here, that means you go 0 in the x direction and up 2 in the y direction. So starting at the origin, you don't move left and right at all, but you go up to here. And that point you can tell is missing. This is 0, 2. That's not given, uh, not plotted, excuse me. Often students confuse this with 2, 0, which by the way is here, because you move over 2 on the x-axis and then don't move up or down at all, right? on the y-axis. So this is a 0 for the y, as opposed to this point where there's a 0 on the x value. So that's the answer here. But let's go through them all. Um, 0, negative 6. Well, 0, don't move at all on the x-axis. Move down the y-axis to this point right here. That's 0, negative 6. They got that one. Negative 6, negative, negative 6, 6. So that means from the origin, move back 6 on the x-axis. That first negative number is the x-axis first, and then up 6 on the y-axis to this point right here, that's negative 6, 6, and then 9, 4, go over 9 on the x-axis and up 4 on the y-axis to this point right here. So just a matter of remembering x before y, and that ties back to the uh, science idea or the general idea that x is the independent variable which comes first, and then y depends on that. So it's the, usually referred to as the dependent or second variable. All right, thanks.